Hello dear students, welcome to Devika's Commerce and Management Academy. Today we will work out one problem where they are asking mean, median, mode together how to work out. You have seen in the previous classes how to calculate mean separately median, separately mode together how to prepare. This is very important from the examination point of view. In exams nobody will ask you to calculate median, calculate mean, they will ask you to calculate three together. So that is why I will make you a practice of working out this in one problem. <clears throat> now see the problem, calculate mean, median, mode. What is the data given to us? Mid value is given not x, mid value is given frequency. First of all, mid value we have to turn it into x, okay, so that we will do first, x. How to take the x? Mid value difference, any difference if you take phi, okay, phi divided, already I taught you this one difference is 5, 5 make it half means 2.5, 2.5 if you deduct from 5 you will get lower class interval, if you add to this 5 you will get upper class interval, right. So the difference is here 5, 5 make it half divided by 2 means 2.5, 2.5 if I deduct from this I will get lower class interval, means if I deduct from this 5 minus 2.5, 2.5. 2.52 if I add 2.5 upper class interval that is 7.5 in the same way here also 7.5 and 12.5 here 12.5 what we are doing deducting 2.5 we are getting lower class interval adding we are getting upper class interval 12.5 to 17.5 17.5 to 22.5 22.5 to 27.5, 27.5 to 32.5, like this you got the class interval, x, problem I am not going to work out, you have to work out, I will explain you, that is it. First of all, whenever you find this mean, median mode, get in your mind, what are the formulas, x, mean formula, what is the formula of mean, x bar is equal to sigma f m by n, formula you got it, according to that what do we need, first of all mid value, mid value already given, what else is needed, frequency into mid value, so I will provide one column frequency into mid value, this I will get, okay, total of this is sigma f m, n is total of this frequency, columns I have fm I will calculate, put it in the formula so that I will be getting the x bar that is arithmetic mean value, mean is over, next median, median what are the two formulas are there, first formula is median is equal to size of n by 2th item and what is the second formula, m is equal to l plus n by 2 minus c of by n into i, this is the formula, right. Whenever you want to calculate median either in discrete series or continuous series, immediately first thing what you have to do is CF, cumulative frequency you have to calculate. So I will provide a column for CF, only this column is enough, CF you will get, then you will apply the n by 2th item, wherever it lies in CF you will identify the class interval and you will apply this formula, we have done already, okay. So like this median you are going to find out. Next after that mode, mode, for mode uh, if you see the frequency, highest frequency is 30, next highest is 25, there is a difference, so that is why by inspection mode lies in so and so class interval, you can write one sentence. So this is mean, median and coming to mode, you can write by inspection. mode lies in which class interval here, 30 is the highest frequency now, so mode lies in 17.5 to 22.5, yeah 22.5, we have written one sentence then after that write the formula, what is the formula did you remember, mode formula is L plus 
डी वन बाई डी वन प्लस डी टू इंटू आई अप्लाई दिस एंड यू विल गेट मोड ऑल्सो सो दिस इज योर होमवर्क प्रॉब्लम आई एम नॉट गोइंग टू वर्कआउट बिकॉज वी हैव डन इनफ प्रॉब्लम्स जस्ट इन वन ग्लैंस आई एक्सप्लेन यू हाउ टू प्रिपेयर मीन मीडियम मोड डो नॉट गेट कन्फ्यूज फर्स्ट सी द फॉर्मुला रिकलेक्ट द फॉर्मुला राइट इट अकॉर्डिंग टू द फॉर्मा फॉर्मुला विच कॉलम इज रिक्वायर्ड As per this formula, we need FM. FM means calculate FM. Before going to the FM, first we found class interval x from the width value. Okay, FM we have calculated, and the second one is that median. For median, two formulas write it: size of n by two theta term. Then next formula L plus n by two minus e of by uh, n into i. Sorry, this is frequency. F into i. Okay. So this is the formula. N by two theta means first we need CF cumulative frequency. Prepare that. Identify where it lies. Then according to that apply this formula. And uh, third one is that mode we need. For mode you can go simply by inspection mode lies in seventeen point two, seven point five to seventeen point five to twenty two point five. Write the formula. L one plus D one by D one by D one plus D two into I. Okay. So according to that prepare it. By the way, you have to work out these problems. Answers are given here. X bar arithmetic mean is eighteen point two five, median is eighteen point three three, and mode is eighteen point seven five. How many of you are getting same answers? Let me know in the comment box. Please write it and practice well. With today's class, I can say confidently that mean, median, mode we have completed. and also geometric mean harmonic mean also we have covered all long back only so practice well in the next class next chapter of statistics i am going to teach stay connected and do share this videos with your friends juniors or seniors because everything is free of cost for you all and stay connected practice well good luck